Grammar Two for Level Two Students, Chapter Ten: The Passive. Passive forms of the perfect tenses. Future perfect. Interrogative sentence. See the structure. The sentence begins with the auxiliary verb will, then the subject, and it is the object of the active sentence. Then have been, and after that the verb is in the past participle form by the preposition, and finally the object, and it is the subject of the active sentence. See the examples. This is an active sentence in the future perfect, and it is an interrogative sentence. Will he have sent a letter before I arrive? In the sentence, he have sent what? And this is the object, a letter. A letter is the object of this verb sent. Another verb arrive, but it doesn't have any object. Now change this interrogative sentence into a statement. He will have sent a letter before I arrive. Now this active sentence is in the affirmative form as a statement, and the object of the active sentence becomes the subject in the passive. A letter is the subject in the passive, and then we put will have been, and the transitive verb is in the past participle form. Sent by the preposition, and the subject of the active sentence becomes the object in the passive. Here it is him. And since there is no object for this verb arrive, we cannot change this sentence into passive. Still, this sentence is in the affirmative form as a statement. Now change this affirmative sentence into an interrogative sentence by putting will or the helping verb just before the subject, and say this one. It is in the beginning of the sentence. Before the subject, a letter, and just it. Will a letter have been sent by him before I arrive? And the affirmative statement has been changed into an interrogative sentence in the passive form. Another example. This sentence is in the interrogative form, but in the negative. Will he have not sent a letter before I arrive? In this sentence, a letter is the object of this verb sent. Change this interrogative sentence into a statement. He will have not sent a letter before I arrive. Now it is in the negative as a statement, and in the passive, the object of the active sentence becomes the subject. A letter is now is the subject, and for the future perfect in the passive form, we write will have been. Since it is negative, we put not between have and been. Will have not been. Then the past participle form of the transitive verb sent by the preposition and the subject of the active sentence becomes the object in the passive him. And after the conjunction, there is another verb, but it doesn't have any object. We cannot change this part into passive. And finally, change this negative sentence into an interrogative sentence by placing will at the beginning of the sentence. We place will before the subject. Will a letter have not been sent by him before I arrive? And it is an interrogative sentence in the passive form.